Today's video is going to teach you about the top five budget free safeties in Madden NFL 16 Ultimate Team. Guys, for those of you who are new to our YouTube channel, I want to go ahead and welcome you to the video today. My name is Cody, and our goal here at this YouTube channel is to teach you how to get better at Madden NFL 16. That's our ultimate goal, and we do that through a variety of different types of series. And um, in today's video, we're on our Mutt Budget series, and this series is devoted to basically giving you five players in Ultimate Team that you can take a look at that are budget friendly and what I mean by that is they're 5,000 coins or less and then normally we also give you an option uh, towards the end of the video that's a little bit more expensive but it has a lot of value uh, in terms of what you're going to get for what you pay so definitely want to uh, definitely want to kind of keep this series going I hope you guys are enjoying it and today we're talking about the top five budget free safeties but before we do that guys if you're looking to improve your defense in Madden NFL 16, I highly recommend taking a look in the description below, and you're going to be able to find access to some purchase links, and you're going to be able to purchase a defensive ebook that I've put together for you. It's very inexpensive compared to pretty much anybody else that have put out defensive uh, material this season, and so uh, I feel like it's one of the best ones, and hopefully uh, you guys do too. So far, I haven't had a ton of negative comments, and pretty much anything that is negative we've taken care of within a couple days. And most people have had pretty pretty good success with the scheme itself, and, and that's what I'm really proud of. So hopefully you guys will enjoy that content too. But anyways, without further ado, guys, we're taking a look here at the top five free safeties for uh, your coin. And so the first one we're going to take a look at, this is one of my favorite guys recently. Uh, I really like this guy. This is a Road to the Playoffs Edition card. And um, the real quick, the key stats that we looked at when we looked at free safeties, we looked at a couple of things. We looked at zone coverage first because I think that that's one of the most important things that a safety can possess. The second thing we looked at is, is speed. Um, well, in speed in terms of, like, pursuit, how he's going to basically tackle, kind of clean things up. That's what we're looking for. And then um, the third thing we looked at is uh, catching or, like, spec catch or is he going to make the turnover kind of thing. Those are the, really the keys that we were looking at when we looked at the uh, safety. So, First one is a Road to the Playoffs edition card. He comes to us from the Chicago Bears, and is this? It is this guy right here. His name is Adrian Amos, and he's going for about 1,500 coins right now. Very inexpensive, and for the value you get with this coin, I mean, he's pretty solid. Take a look at his stats here. Um, he's he does a lot of things really well for you at free safety. Uh, first things first is he has 94 speed, uh, 94 speed, and 85 zone coverage is is a is a pretty good combination to have at that free safety position. The other thing that he actually has, uh, interesting enough, is he has 76 man coverage, so you can actually play some man uh, with this guy. If you get him matched up on a running back or something, normally he'll be fairly all right for you. Um, his hit power and is not really that great, but again, I don't quite value it as much um, at the free safety position. What I like about this card is, number one, he has good zone coverage. Number two, he has that 94 speed, so he's not going to get burned a lot. And the other thing that I really like about this card he has 64 catching, which is okay. Um, his tackling is decent at 67. Uh, normally, the threshold for safeties is about 70 to 80. That's what I look for. This guy's really close to that. Uh, block sheds at 66. So, again, for the most part, this guy is your basic budget-friendly guy, and uh, he's really going to be there for you when you want to play zone coverage. Okay, so that is the um, that's the Adrian Amos player. Uh, the next one that I want to talk about. This is one of my personal favorite. Uh, budget safeties, and I really, I really like this guy a lot um, because he does a lot of things well for the defense. And so that guy comes to us. Uh, he comes to us from the Miami Dolphins. It's actually another Road to the Playoffs edition card, uh, and his name is Michael Thomas. You're going to see 79 overall, Michael Thomas, about 1,800 coins, very similar in price to the uh, Adrian Amos card. And we're going to take a look at this guy. What you're going to see here is you're going to see that he has a 90 speed, which is about the threshold. I mean, obviously you don't have to have 90 speed when you're talking about free safeties, but the better the speed, I just, you know, I, I really value speed this season for some reason, uh, just because of the high, high volume that people are running like verticals and, and deep streaks. Also, he's 83 zone coverage, which is fairly good for uh, what he also has, which is really cool here, is he has 73 tackling. 85 pursuit and 83 hit power so he's going to be able to play the run and the pass he's a very balanced safety he's probably the most balanced out of all the guys we're going to talk about today um, in my opinion he does a lot of things well um, and he's just a really versatile type player 
And if you're looking to improve your defense, I highly recommend having a guy like this on your team. Uh, he can do a lot of things for you. And so from a zone coverage perspective, because that's what I like to play, I highly, highly appreciate this card. All right, guys, the next card that we are uh, taking a look at here, he comes to us from the, let's see, what team is he on here? Comes to us from the Houston Texans. And I like this player mainly because uh, this is a really focal, he focuses on pass defense, basically. This guy is what you want to use for your pass defense. He's, that's, that's pretty much his niche, right? That's what he wants to play, right? So that's who we're looking at right now. And uh, this guy comes to us from the Houston Texans, the free safety, and it's an 83 overall base set edition of Raheem Moore. Now, the reason I like this guy is he's very budget friendly. As you can see here, only about 2,500 coins right now on the market. But the other thing is, if you're having trouble stopping the aggressive catch up the middle of the field, this guy is one of the best in the business of doing that. Here's why. Number one, he's six foot one. Number two, he's got 84 hip power safety, which again, like we saw with that Michael Thomas, he's very, very effective. The only thing he doesn't really have is speed. As you can see here, that 84 speed is not quite elite. And at safety, it is somewhat of a liability. But again, he's backed off, so you have that kind of window. So that's why I kind of leave it alone. 89 zone coverage, really solid. I've never really got beat with this guy, uh, and I used him for a long time in the beginning of the season. 89 zone coverage for our safety, that's really, really good. That's the second highest out of, uh, out of anybody we're going to talk about today. And he also has uh, some interesting stats when you go take a look at his catching. He has 75 catching, which is one of the best in the entire game for a safety or a corner, uh, except for those like out-of-position guys. He also has 80 spectacular catching, which is really, really solid. So this guy is just one of those guys, like if you're struggling against like aggressive catch kind of guys, this is one of the guys you want to have in your lineup. As you can see here, uh, he does a lot of things well for your, for your offense. All right, guys, so the number two guy, I want to see what he's going for in the market right now. He's kind of right at that threshold uh, of players, and if he's not going, and you see he is, unfortunately, he is going for a little bit higher. And that's this Rodney McLeod, or McLeod player, and I'm just going to go ahead and recommend to him here. Just a short note on this guy. Uh, he's going for about 8,000 right now. But if you take a look at this guy, he's got 90 speed, he's got 87 zone, he's got 86 hip power, 74 tackling, 77 pursuit. 94 acceleration the other thing that he has is a 71 catch so the cool part about this this safety is like is basically that when you put him, when you throw him in the mix he's really really solid for pretty much anything he, he can do pretty much everything that you want this mark baron card i'm not quite as sold on he has really good hip power really good speed but his coverage stats are a little off so if you wanted to use her this guy possibility but for my purposes, I'm, I'm going to leave him be. Um, the next guy that I wanted to talk about uh, in today's video is, uh, I kind of went back and forth. I didn't really know if I wanted this guy or if I wanted that guy and who I really wanted here with this specific position um, on our list because there's a lot of different options. Um, you could go zone coverage, you could go man coverage, you could do whatever you want here. But what I'm looking at is uh, what I see in this guy is a lot of value and a lot of things that you can you can really, you know, he can really do for you, and uh, I really enjoy this guy. So this guy comes to us from the Green Bay Packers, and uh, his name is uh, Ha Ha Clinton Dix. And what we like about this guy, it's this, it's the 80 overall Shetter Star, just a basic, very basic item. Uh, but what you'll see with this card, if you look into it, is um, he's going to give you 87 speed, which is pretty solid at safety. He's also going to give you 85 zone coverage, which again is pretty solid at safety. He's going to give you 78 tackling, which is pretty solid from a safety. 79 pursuit, 84 hit power. Also gives you 76 man coverage, so he can do pretty much everything on the field. And the other key stat is he got 78 catching, and uh, he also is uh, going to do a really good job. He can actually block shut a little bit um, and does a lot of things really well for you. So just a quick overview of this card, but... In my opinion, he's one of the best budget options. He may be the best all-around budget safety in the game, but I really, really like this card. And then the final card that I want to talk about is a card that I've had on my team since the very beginning of the season, and I've had a ton of success. He, if you think that if you value speed, you may not necessarily like this selection, but I think this guy is one of the best for my my coins 
uh, at this budget type of um, trying to keep these guys under you know 5,000 coins and that is um, the uh, Cleveland Browns Madden 16 Ultimate Team uh, base edition of Tashwan Gibson. Now, he has a team MVP item out that's also very good. Fixes a couple of his issues in this base set, but this this guy, um, I've never had an issue with this guy. He always seems to make plays for me, and uh, he does have 83 speed, but the 88 acceleration helps him to kind of close really well on guys, and again, he's at safety, so he's already going to be back. He's already going to be backed off the line of scrimmage uh, pretty much in any type of defense you run. Now, um, but we did give you some speed guys if you value the speed, so I don't really feel guilty about this. But anyway, uh, he has 93 zone coverage. That's the best out of any of the safeties we've talked about so far. Uh, that's pretty much on a corner level. Like, that's really solid zone coverage. The other thing that he's got um, is he's got some decent tackling, 75. He doesn't have hit power, unfortunately. That's really the only thing. Hit power and speed are the only thing that he really doesn't have, but he does have 82 catching. This guy is going to – this guy's a turnover machine. Uh, he just makes so many interceptions for me, and uh, I highly, highly recommend this card. I've never really had an issue with him uh, outside of maybe one or, once or twice, but if you feel like you may get beat, you may want to sub in one of your speed guys if they have speed threats out there, but normally this guy's going to do you well. Now, I wanted to give you an option here. I wanted to give you some options if you're looking to uh, go to that next level of safety. So... We talked about the budget guys, and what we like to do now is we like to give you one, maybe two options uh, if you want to upgrade your uh, your guys from you know budget safety to value safety. And uh, the guy that I like to use to uh, to do this is, uh, and he comes to us from uh, he comes to us from the I think he comes yep from the New England Patriots, and I really like this guy a lot. Uh, that's Devin McCourty. Uh, from the New England Patriots. Now, this guy um, is going for a little bit more than I probably would pay for him right now. Uh, I actually was able to get him at a time when the market was pretty good for him. Um, but here, you're going to take a look at this guy. He's going for about 50. Actually, no, he's gone down some. So he's going for about 15K right now. And the key to this guy, what I love about him, is he has pretty much everything we want from a coverage perspective. Now, from a run defense perspective, he still does pretty good for a couple of reasons. We're going to point those out to you real quick. He has 90 speed, which means he's going to be able to, you know, kind of really protect that deep vertical. He also has 85 man coverage, so if you want to mix it up, throw some cover one style mans on your opponent. This guy can play man for you. Um, he also has 94 zone coverage. That's the highest out of anybody we've talked about so far. He has um, 63 hit power, which is not very good. 67 tackle, which is average at best for safety. But he has 82 Pursuit, and the 82 Pursuit rating is going to help you a little bit because it's going to get him in the vicinity. I've never really had an issue with this guy. Um, and he's got that 92 jump. He's got good catching uh, that you're going to be able to utilize. He doesn't have great block shed, but again, he's a free safety, right? Uh, if we want to block shed, we'd be going after, uh, you know, guys like, you know, different, different guys than just that guy. So there's that guy for you if you're looking for a coverage guy. If you're looking for just an all-around really solid player, um, as far as for your safety, from your safety spot here, I want to show you this guy real quick. I don't, he actually probably could have even made our list here. Um, maybe. I don't know for sure because his zone cover isn't great. But it is the Road to the Playoffs edition of Darian Stewart, Darian Stewart from the Denver Broncos, the 84 overall free safety. And what this guy is going to give you is going to give you that 88 speed, which is really good for our safety. So he's going to give you that hit power. He's going to give you that ability to stop the run as well with some pretty good zone coverage at 84. Now, for a base safety, this probably is one of the best run-stopping free safeties we're going to talk about. And uh, as you can see here, this guy's really solid uh, across the board, really. Uh, and he does pretty good in a lot of areas. Uh, the main thing that he's going to do for you is he's going to be in a decent position to stop most passes, and he's also going to... Uh, do a good job at stopping the uh, stopping the run for you. Those are the main attributes that that guy's going to do for you. And he does it he does it pretty well. Uh, another guy is the base set Tyron Matthew, but um, you know these guys are some of the guys that you want to add to your squad uh, if you're looking to improve your pass coverage game. That's what we're looking to. And uh, these are the safeties that I wanted to talk about today. Now tomorrow we're going to talk about some really good heavy hitters. 
at strong safety. These are guys you're going to want to put on your lineup, and they're going to do a really, really good job for you at stopping the run, coming down in that underneath type zone coverage set uh, specific scenario. We're looking at cover three. We're going to put this guy in a hook zone, flat zone. That's really what he's going to look at, and uh, really, really excited to talk about the uh, strong safety tomorrow. If you missed yesterday's video, we talked about zone covering corners, and the zone covering corner video is really good because it gives you access to, in my opinion, two or three of the top value corners in the entire game. So if you missed that video, you can check that out in the link below. There will be a link to the uh, previous video below. And also, don't forget, guys, there are products available in the description that you can have access to. They're very, very inexpensive. We're talking like 10 bucks for most of these products. And, um, and you're going to be able to have access to full playbook breakdowns, full guides, and things like that. So highly, highly recommend checking out the description for that. Also, guys, uh, to close on one other thing, if you're new to the channel and you have not hit that subscribe button, you don't have to pay for that. That is completely free. You just hit that subscribe button below. It's going to allow you to get access to our future content, and we're going to, uh, it's going to allow us to show you our top five strong safeties in tomorrow's video. So I can't wait to get into that with you guys, and I'm looking forward to it. So we'll see you guys tomorrow. In